Hello there. Good morning. I am in my backyard garden. I'm reading from the Bible. Today I am reading from the book of Psalms. I will read Psalm number 98. Psalm 98 is about praise the judge of the world. But before I get started, I want to talk a little bit about the raised bed garden that you're looking at. This raised bed is starting to fill out nicely. Uh, it is early December and we're able to eat lettuce almost every day. There's enough lettuce in the garden now for us to eat every day. There's some very mild mustard which Normally, I'm not a fan of mustard because it's a really strong flavor, but we've planted one that is very mild. The leaves are more thin than um, normal mustard plants, and it's very mild, so I, I'm enjoying that one. We have some cauliflower and some broccoli that are starting to look like cauliflower and broccoli plants. And the walking stick kale is huge. Um, it's coming along nicely. And there's also onions that we're able to pull out whenever we need an onion for cooking something. So back to Bible reading. Today I'm reading from the book of Psalms. Psalm 98, Praise the Judge of the World. And the reading begins... O oh, sing to the Lord a new song, for he has done marvelous things. His right hand and his holy arm have gotten him victory. The Lord has made known his victory. He has revealed his vindication in the sight of the nations. He has remembered his steadfast love and faithfulness to the house of Israel. All the ends of the earth have seen the victory of our God. Make a joyful noise to the Lord, all the earth. Break forth into joyous song and sing praises. Sing praises to the Lord with the lyre, with the lyre and the sound of melody, with trumpets and the sound of the horn. Make a joyful noise before the King, the Lord. Let the sea roar and all that fills it, the world and those who live in it. Let the floods clap their hands. Let the hills sing together for joy at the presence of the Lord, for he is coming to judge the earth. He will judge the world with righteousness and the peoples with equity. Here ends the reading of Psalm number 98.